Gambao prefers with Saul Crespo and Osama both getting a start. So off we go. One more quarter in the Indian Oil Duran Cup. There's Roshan. Now Diego Maurizio. The flag has stayed down and Diego Maurizio has hit it wide. Shubham looking for the diagonal. There's the header. Saul Crespo and uh, Jingan going up for it. It's still in the box and Nanda shot is straight to Goodfried. So there you see a wave of white shirts up there defending. Especially Sunil Chetri getting back. Shubham. There's the cross. Jovanovic's flick. High boot in yeah. the end. Javi again. This time it's a much better delivery. Ralte's punch. The referee's seen something he doesn't like. Yeah, I think the goalkeeper came out very well. What's the plan? Javi takes it. There's the header. It goes wide. The idea was very good and how to put the ball on the far. Better this time, Prabir with some time. Flag is stayed down. Cherry. Creates some room, sends in a very dangerous cross. It's just bundled away. And enough time for Roshan to clear this. And not only has he cleared it, he's found Roy Krishna who can charge down. Pushed and shoved over there. Roy Krishna with his brilliance gets behind the defenders and up front there. He just doesn't have any support over there. Couldn't pull the ball back because there were two defenders on him. And look at the way three of them inside. He had to make the option to put that ball far behind. Not only stop that ball but collect it from the blind. Oh, it's a poor header sometimes when you go up like that. You have to be confident. You'll get all of your forehead onto it. But uh, at half time, it's been a tetchy, often scrappy. Nine halves of football, Odisha have played without conceding a goal. Continue to keep it tight at the back. And there were some questions raised, Henry. Parag over the top. Rohit brings it down. Pressure from Sahil. And then in steps Delgado. Which was Diego Maurizio winning it in a great area. Now Nanda. Nanda opens up his body. He couldn't find that girl that he was looking for. Space down the right. Instead he's picked out Javi. Inside the box. Javi with the send. Almost sent it to Sunil Chetri. It's first time he saw that break the defence. That two with the one-two passes. Javi sends it in. It's a good delivery and Jovanovic. How close was that? Bruno Ramirez, Parag's cross, seen away by Delgado, the whistle had gone. Yep. We're wondering what happened up. The chance for us for offside. Another cross, this time deeper towards Ivanovic, Roy Krishna. There's the attempt, asking for handball, and then sliced away by Tanish. Full time then, and we are heading into 30 more minutes of football. Still not separated. Separated in terms of how many men there are on the pitch for each side. Shubham Sarangi was sent off, so Risha down to 10. And now ready to kick start. Extra time. Third is going to be different.
Tanish. Fezel. Pass to Sairaj. Low ball in. And Leon's take. And Shiva Shakti. As usual. Comes on and changes every game. The completion of the chair team totally changes when you have fresh pairs of legs, fresh pair of legs. And that's exactly what happened. Look at that. Faisal's cross. There was a tap over there. Gone back. Goalkeeper does well to keep it down. And she was Shakti every time. Rainier inside into that great area. And oh. Looked like it was Pedro Martin peeling away at the far post. Uh, given away. And now a chance for Shiva Shakti to settle and bury this game. Great save from Ralte. Danish. Then the sliding tackle. And what somehow Odisha survive. I swear. What a chance that was inside the box. Another one. At this time cleared away. Sahil sends it in. It's a good ball. Diego Maurizio there. Oh, oh it's gone in. Diego Maurizio has scored an equaliser in the 115th minute. And this game is it's absolutely remarkable, this match. And Bengaluru might have thought that it's done and dusted. Orisha had second thoughts. With seconds left, and Roy Krishna takes a shot. Oh! And tell you what, that is exactly why you don't give the ball away like that when you've got Roy Krishna on the pitch. A winner in the dying seconds. And Bengaluru have surely, surely done enough. Only when we were talking about how much effort uh, Odisha FC has put in in the game with 10 men. All of a sudden the ball was given away. And then this pass coming in, Roy Krishna, nobody marking him. So close to his own goal. If you put the ball up, put the ball out in the opponent's half, not in your own half. This is somewhere the experience lacks, you know, a player lacks in experience. And this man, he does what he wants. He can score goals from left, from right. And this time, he has scored goal at the right time. 120th minute, bang on the clock. And he has scored for his team to get into the semi-finals. What a match this has been. So in the four Duran Cups that Bengaluru have taken part in, they have made it to the semis three times. I did not expect this. Especially in the dying seconds, you know, this is where it counts. Experience counts.